Hello everyone, it's been a long time and I, and I do apologize for the long delays and my silence. It's been a busy, busy time. But we're here. I thought we would start with something that I just got very recently with my own money. It is a ring light and I thought, looking at the researchers, I thought this is one of the best value for money that I could find online. So it is the Viltrox VL500B forward slash 500T, whatever. So it comes in this neat package and outside it just gives all of the descriptions that you would normally want to know and are interested. The key thing is the fact that it has a variable color temperature and it goes up from 3300 Kelvin to 5600 Kelvin. And it also has 1550 lux at 0.5 meters. That's pretty remarkable from a package that is, at the time of this video, it costs around 55 pounds on Amazon. So, 1550 lux at 0.5 at 2000 lumens at 0.5 meters as well. It's around 650 grams, that and about. But there are some interesting features why I decided to get this. Before we do that, let's just get this open with. Full disclosure, I've been using this for almost a week and I've just stuffed everything in just to pretend that I'm opening for the first time and try to represent how it actually looks. So, in the package, pretty straightforward package, you've got the light itself. We we'll leave that for the side. Some leaflets, a warranty, and it comes with a power cord. That's the adapter. It comes with a charger because it fits SNF 550 batteries to it and they very kindly include one as well. So this is a 2000 milliamp hour battery. Uh, that they include with it which is which is very good I thought micro USB I know USB-C is the way to go but look at least they include it it's a short cable but hey and they also include the adapter which is great and it comes handy in so many different reasons because they got the mounting thread and a hot shoe mount all very very good which is, which is everything you ever wanted essentially okay let's get rid of the package all you want to see is this so out it comes and it looks like that it's super flush super thin and let's go through it back so it comes in this nice neat package and it's very very flush and white in here that's supposed to give a very diffused light all A plus and at the back you have you have the power button on and off and you've got the adjustment for two two things uh, that will come up on the display and here's where the battery goes in for all purposes I'll just use the battery and by the way this battery came uh, at least 75% charged which was which was very good so slot the battery in and we switch it on and that is super super bright I mean honestly it's it's, it's actually much more powerful than the uh, key light that I have here and just on the back here so you have you have the amount of power that you want coming out as you can see you can decrease it all the way down to 20% give it a touch and you can change the Kelvin as well to a very nice orangey effect I kind of like this it's very it's it's very good pushed up to full power and let's change the Kelvin there sure I look very spooky in this okay now we just need to mount this onto something so that we have a point of reference to see how 
this actually is functional screws in very easily for all intensive purposes I'm just going to use the uh, trusty switch pod which I really enjoy anyway by the way I'll put a I make a review of this sometime later on as well so that works very well and again you can bring it down and bring it up fantastic there you go so it's a nice, nice and plush and that's how it works so I'm just going to switch off my key light and see how it how it functions without that so that's without the key light it's just a ring light at the back there and let's turn this on I think it I'm guessing it's looking nice there it's got a nice soft diffuse diffusion light which is remarkable for for something of this price it's very portable it's very mini okay so I've been using this for about a month now I'll just turn back the uh, the main light there I've been using this almost for a week and there are a couple of things that I really really like one thing is how much it weighs it's only about 650 plus the addition of let's say 100 grams for the battery and the second thing is the hot shoe mount that it comes that's fantastic and it attaches to anything with a, a three quarter inch thread now while that hot shoe mount is great and the way it attaches it gives itself a problem because for all purposes the way that um, that hot shoe is mounted and the position at which creates itself its own problem it's fantastic if you just have it like that no problem at all but the problem comes when you tilt it forward because let's imagine that's how you want and yeah you see where I'm going anyway this is the problem that it has now the switch board gets around it because you can obviously unscrew it you can move it to the side and then aim for where the leg is forward so there's no way that's going to fall so it is a minor technicality it, it feels like it's just going to fall apart if that strengthening beam is not there there are other ones that I've seen on Amazon where the the fixture is actually on the side that tends to give it a little bit more strength so two on the side and it's actually like a bracket so you can just tilt it on that axis that seems to be a alternative that seems to work very well because the center of gravity then is gravitated down rather than at an angle a um, couple of other things if you have a bigger size battery that's going to add weight to it and the tipping effect is going to be much more pronounced a couple of other things when the charge actually drops it drops very quickly with such a small battery that is included the output is rather low you can feel the strength of the light dimming down very quickly and noticeably now the plus point is because you can have this fixed to a main power source at all given points it gets around that very very quickly and it is a long power cord I mean it's it'll get you around most problems it's it's long enough you're not going to you're not going to run into problems with it the battery is great if, if you want to shoot outside the light is light <laughs> see what I did there it's a light light and you can mount it any way you like so in from the purposes of most things 
It's remarkable and especially given the value of around £50. It's great. I would definitely recommend this uh, for most video, video uh, productions for amateurs who don't really want to splash out on really expensive lighting systems to get that crisp light. This does everything. It's got a soft diffuse light that we all love that is very very good. Okay, so that wraps around our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I will be back with another video very soon, I promise this time, with more in-depth video. See you next time.